Charlie, new overnight, Portland Mayor Ted Wheeler gets caught in a cloud of tear gas and another riot was declared downtown. The mayor joined more than a thousand protesters for the city's 55th day of protesting against racial injustice. Elise Haas is live this morning to show us what happened last night. Elise. Ken, once again, people gathered outside the federal courthouse and the Justice Center, and notably, one of those people was Mayor Ted Wheeler. So he joined the crowd and came up all the way to the fence, basically the front lines of where these protests are happening. And this is video of him in the sea of tear gas, as that he was trying to leave that area. You can see in that video that he's wearing a mask, you see the back of his head, and he is coughing. And while Wheeler addressed the crowd earlier in the day, hundreds Hundreds of people chanted and screamed for his resignation while other people were lighting off fireworks. Mayor Wheeler said that he came out to hear the concerns and answer protesters' questions. We are on the front line here in Portland. If we are not able to get the federal administration to back off and leave our city, it will happen all across the United States, jeopardizing our United States Constitution. Later overnight, people began climbing over the new fence around the federal courthouse. Our reporters witnessed that, along with officers and our reporters witnessing people lighting fires, shooting fireworks, and throwing Molotov cocktails at the courthouse. Around 12.30 this morning, Portland police declared a riot. Portland police tweeted that people would be subject to arrests or impact weapons if they did not leave the area. But many people stayed. Our reporter said that this riot was largely unenforced by law enforcement. Police say people continued to throw things, and at one point, they say fire hydrants were opened, dumping several hundred gallons of water into the street. Coming back out here live, you'll see maybe through, it's really dark right now, but there's still um, protesters out and about. People are in the streets. Some people are holding signs near the park. Um, and there's a lot of different people who are walking around through this area. So we're going to continue to stay on scene and monitor the situation, and we'll bring you updates on air throughout the morning as well as at coin.com. Reporting live in downtown Portland, Elise Haas, Coin 6 News. All right, thank you, Elise.